Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lynette and it's a tourism channel where we talk about tourism, travel, all those amazing things. We throw in some culture, some interviews whenever we can. Otherwise, that's all we have for you guys. If it's your first time on my channel, feel free to like this video if you enjoy it. Subscribe to my channel because so many videos keep coming up. Like this particular trip which I'm showing you right now, we're going to Kidepo Valley National Park and I have four to five videos so be sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification button so that you don't miss a thing. Otherwise, get ready for this amazing video and the adventure was crazy, it was a four day trip, it was amazing. So just stay tuned and enjoy this. So the trip uh, had been estimated to be seven to eight hours but ended up being um, up to 13 to 14 hours because we reached our destination at midnight coming actually it was around one when we got to the campsite of Morogoro this is where we stayed for the few first few nights and then entered Kidepo Valley National Park. So we had two buses, two Uwa buses, and we were traveling with the mountain slayers who organized the trip, developed the itinerary, and were taking care of everything. Yeah, so if it's a, if it's a first time to hear about the mountain slayers, check them out in their different channels. You know, let me ask me any questions about traveling to the north, how far is it, what should you carry, because Morogoro was a bit of a hot area. So traveling light is highly recommended because it's a bit hot and you know ensuring sustainable tourism is all we do so we, we we encourage you not to litter or to carry any polythene bags on the trail yeah So the road was very good. The road was well tarmacked all the way from Kampala to Kitigum. It was tarmacked road, like you can see there. You know, we had a really smooth ride. You could see a change in vegetation from the really populated Kampala. And as we kept going upwards, you know, you could see less houses on the sides, more green, more green, you know. And as we got into deeper into Kitigum, Padel, we got to see more huts on the sides and those are my friends having fun. Yeah, the, the bus was lit, there was so much music, there were drinks going around with our amazing driver Tony who just in, ensured that everything was fantastic. Otherwise, bye! So we arrived at the campsite uh, an hour back. It's one in the it's two in the morning, and people are still setting up their tents. <laughs> A little bit. People are setting up. It's two in the morning. We shall be up, I believe, by seven or eight tomorrow or today. <laughs> yeah. 